E for eminiwizard.com and marketwizard.com just after 10 o'clock, 13th of June, 2019. Mining traders use risk capital you can afford to lose. CCAD suggests that the half gap is 86 and a half. Anybody that has got to the 88s <clears throat> to 87s paid for sure. If you took a shot at it, Make sure you don't let it get away from you. <clears throat> we said we're going to leave <clears throat> chips on the table today for sure. Just because of the potential for crazy swings. Char <clears throat> Charlie gave him the ball at the new high. Half gap is achieved. Stops down. The 40 back is going to be 85 and a half. We said 85. This low right here. He is support until broken. Gap is back here in, in the middle neighborhood. Speaks to the symmetry of this target. Still using 98 as our resistance. And we said, let's monitor 91. We've got to get through yesterday's high to come back in and eat into yesterday's range, just like down here. This was the same idea. Stops down. There's a double right here. We've identified this as a double and this down here as a double. These are all important. Anybody gets the 40 back, I said, I'd be happy if we could get 40 back. Be happy, get paid. Anybody that's short side, make sure you are paid. We can do anything. I said, if we break this low, we can do anything today. We've got this big gotcha bar right here. There's a third time through trade right here. And we said because of rollover, we could get some crazy swings today. <clears throat> Accumulate. Hit and run. I said it'll probably take two or three. Maybe the second mouse will get it. And we see all these tails forming and kind of stall and stall. And then we get back through at 91. And then this is all, all of these traders here from basically about, what, four o'clock-ish. You know, these, these traders now are basically just giving them back. So the question is, is this defended by the boys or not? A bounce will be because traders are taking profits. That's all we know. Anytime we are blessed with a gift, take it. Going to leave chips on the table today. We know that. And this is the predictive model that we just talked about. These are the resistance highs that the boys are trying to bust. This is the pipe. So now we have the right to move this down. Say, okay, support. Fighting. Resistance. And this 91 is our flipper. So keep an eye on that. Anybody got the half gap? Good for you. Lock it. And because we've gone from low to high, I want to think conservatively. And that means we'll be leaving chips on the table. And you're going to need multiple entries today, no matter how you play. If you decide to play, some of you may not want to play at all. If you're not, you know, well versed in seeing rollover, then you're better off, you know, just watching for, uh, you know, a couple of sessions. All right, resistance zone help so far. We also have our support zone holding for now. So what can I say? Range type trading is what we said. Good possibility, right? I said, let's think of the range as the pipe. Correct? So here we are. That works.
So, so at least our system helps us to identify likely ranges and likely areas where it will stall. And nobody knows whether this type of a plunge keeps on coming. I mean, look at it last night, you know, step by step. Here's one, here's two, here's the third, here's a fourth. And you come back up one, two, three. Remember I'd said, make sure you paid by 82s and the thing bolts up two more levels. So for now, all we know is that this has been resistance. This is largely our fighting box Been rejected for now. And this is theoretical support box. And the gap down here. Like I said earlier, I'm, my preference is to hit a bounce or two. I know the bots don't care, but after all this and with rollover, I thought better odds to come back in. Please test the 85s. I love to see the 82s get tested too, and even lower, but I'm not a pig. So we're using that idea, the gap 81 app, 82 support. We're going to use this uh, 92 area right in here. And then obviously we take out 98s, anything goes, including up here. And if we're subject to news events today, uh, I, I'd certainly like to see some retracing the overnight range rather than making new highs, but that, that's just my preference. Either way, lock profits and <clears throat> be happy that you got something if you've, you've played this direction. And they've made yesterday's um, high, the middle for RTH, you can see it. Symmetry right there. All right, well, anytime that you can in the IB, get your half gap, that's a good sign. And the question is, can you bust it and get more? But still, you're, it, it means you had a common sense trade. This is one of our favorite trades, half gap trade, by the way. It, it just means that you played the odds and, okay, it got rewarded because over time, that's the correct play. And there will be days when that's totally wrong and they just keep squeezing you. But at least they've been fair about this to get you back to the half gap. <clears throat> 